I know, I know, we were just talking and she invited me over. How could I pass that up, right? It's the perfect opportunity to finally find out how she keeps her nails looking so amazing. I know I have great nails. <laughs> but she's gotta have a secret. She doesn't go get her nails done at a professional nail salon in town. She's totally homeschooling her mani-pedi, and that is just so many levels of wrong. Coming, coming. Hi, you're early. Hi, these are for you. One can never have too much vitamin C. Thanks, but that's not really true. Too much vitamin C can cause nausea, diarrhea, and stomach cramps. Ugh, sometimes too much education is a bad thing. Whatever, loser. Make yourself at home. While I go put these um, diarrhea-causing beauties in the kitchen. Can I get you anything? Ooh, I could really go for a beer. I'm feeling kind of butch today. Sorry, butch. I only have wine. Is that okay? Well, anything to make me see double and act single. <laughs> Chanel, Ugh, so last year. Olive green. Ugh. Neon yellow, so 80s, come on. Hey, I was out of Merlot, but I got some white Zippendale. Wine. Gluten-free, dairy-free, and fat-free. I love it. You know, I was thinking... Don't go starting any dangerous precedents there. <laughs> no. How do you keep your nails looking so amazing without ever going to a professional nail salon? You know, I make it my business to go to every nail salon in town and I never see you at any of them. How's that possible? Well, I guess vitamin C and wine really do do the body good. Come on, there has to be some type of secret. Maybe in that blue box over there? Something that keeps your nails nice and strong. You can tell me. I promise I won't tell anyone. Cross my heart and hope to die a horrible death in the hands of a maniac. Well, I do have something I like to do, but I don't really like to talk about it. Come on, you can tell me. I promise not to tell another living soul. You have my word. Well, you would have to promise not to tell anyone else. Of course. What do you take me for a monster? I just gave you my word. Well, okay. Oh, I really should get that. I'll be right back. <sighs> Fuck. Another body has been found with injuries consistent with a troubling string of murders in the area. Remains were taken to the state medical examiner to try to determine their identity and the cause and manner of death, he said, adding that anyone aware of the missing loved ones should contact the police immediately. I'm so sorry, Regina. The box must have slipped out of my hands and opened on the floor. I swear I wasn't snooping and trying to crack it open with a nail file.
I soak them. What? I soak them in blood. <laughs> The gruesome discovery this morning of a tense young woman, her throat sliced open and two fingers severed from her right hand in bushes near the Sliver Lake off-ramp of the Jersey Turnpike. Police are heading up a statewide manhunt for the killer or killers who remain at large. Police are advising anyone with any information to contact the Dover County Hospital. In other news...